Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with a vlog because, well, last night was a little rough for me. Uh, after four days off, I come back to work and it is a mess. Uh, there was things waiting to be put together that no one knew what it was at the time. Uh, it wasn't until I got there that I was able to find out what it was. And uh, I more or less put it entirely together myself. There was a little help getting some stuck bolts because of paint uh, undone. But uh, I, I still don't understand why you'd try to paint over threads, period. But that happened, so some of them were stuck. But uh, more or less, I managed to get the thing put together. And uh, then there was the general work shenanigans... Uh, a little busier than usual. I don't know why. Um, I mean, we are pretty close to the mountain in uh, where I'm living, so maybe people were heading up to the mountain because of the weather, thinking, oh, there'd be, you know, a significant amount of fresh powder, just friggin', eh. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't do that, so I wouldn't know the mentality, but I'm, I'm sure that's probably the case. Um, it at least was a good portion, probably, of their thought process. So, anyway, um, as you can probably hear, the uh, thing is still working its uh, working its magic outside. So, uh, there's that. But, uh, more or less, more or less, uh, my apartment is dry, so that will... Uh, eventually be heading out so that way it'll be nice and quiet when I'm doing recordings. It'll be so nice. It'll be so nice. But anyway, uh, after my long day at work where I was basically playing catch up uh, to everything that had come up during my days off, uh, I uh, didn't really feel like streaming or recording too much. I figured I would move that off for another day. Uh, and instead I went and played a little bit of a social game that, uh, has actually allowed me to be more social as a person now. Um, <laughs> I say that knowing the moment I say the name, some people are instantly going to either go, uh, groan or they're going to freak out in a happier way. <laughs> uh, I've recently gotten more into the uh, scene for VR chat. Uh, now, I don't have a VR headset myself. I, When I was getting the computer, I didn't have enough extra money to uh, purchase a headset on top of everything else, so that's waiting until later. But uh, as it stands for right now, I very much want to. Uh, will that include, you know, getting VR games in the future? Maybe. Uh, at least for the channel? Possibly. It's hard to say. But I have been having a lot of fun, even as a desktop, uh, <laughs> desktop user for VR chat, even though they are <laughs> jokingly looked down upon... Uh, in the game as desktop plebs because, you know, no headset, so not as interactive in that as uh, a lot of other people in that game are. But, I mean, at the same time, I feel, hey, <laughs> if you're playing the game, you're part of the community. So that's how I feel on that. Anyway, um, that said, uh, I had a lot of fun last night uh, just kind of socializing my cares away which is weird because I'm never really a social person I generally shy away from social interactions in general um, at work I kind of put on this mask like uh, I am perfectly you know social as a person I just knocked my pop filter <laughs> um, a perfectly social person who you know will 
talk to you all day if you give me the chance, but most of that's just a facade because I'm just going through the day and dealing with what I can and uh, doing what I need to. And uh, usually after days like that, I'm just drained. I don't want to talk to people. I don't want to, you know, go out and do anything if I can avoid it. Usually if I'm at work, I get my stuff there and I go straight home and I stay there. I don't try to head out and be social uh, as a general rule because at that point I just can't mentally handle it. But with VR chat, it's a different experience. It, I guess it kind of helps put me into a different mindset that way because I, I don't I don't honestly understand uh, what is so different about it but I have loads of fun doing that and I just can't see myself doing that in any other way uh, arguably uh, I was having a little too much fun <laughs> uh last night but uh i mean hey no hangover so there you go uh <laughs> the superpower continues uh no yeah, it just it was it was a very fun night and uh just kind of wanted to i mean make a video i guess kind of promoting vr chat kind of in a way but also uh to mention that I typically have a, you know, semi well-known group of friends, uh, cause they're, you know, they're pretty much everywhere. Um, and, uh, I kind of hang out with them primarily more than I would in say public lobbies of people. Uh, public lobbies of people can be a clown fiesta, as I've heard some people say. It can be a bit of a shit show. Uh, you can get sometimes the worst kind of people uh, in Publix. And I generally hang out in uh, friend groups of people that I know and I respect and I trust. So, um, just saying more likely than not, uh, unless you are, you know, deep into the scene already, you might not end up seeing me all that much. Um, <laughs> but at the same time, if you do end up seeing me, uh, come up and say hi. I mean, as much as coming up and saying hi can be, uh, depending on your situation. But uh, do it. If you see me, go right ahead. Uh, my... Uh, my uh, my title, uh, my tag in game, my name tag is the Stray Cat. Uh, it, I had a chance to go for that, so I went for it. Uh, so if you happen to see me in VR chat as the Stray Cat, go ahead and say hi. If you happen to see me at all, absolutely do it. <laughs> I would love to see you. But uh, yeah, it's it's weird how I feel more social in that game than I tend to in general. But I, I I don't know, I guess if it's helping me in that way, fuck it, keep going. <laughs> but anyway, uh, this is enough of me singing praises for VR chat. Uh, <laughs> uh, this is also technically an apology for not recording or streaming anything yesterday, but I was just so drained. I ended up doing all of that. Uh, work dragged on a little longer than usual anyway, despite that. Uh, getting all that taken care of, mainly because there was so much to do. But uh, once I got all that taken care of, I had to grab a few things at work. Uh, grab myself a little treat because I figured, you know, I had done a lot. I grabbed myself a, uh, you know, full slab of ribs. Because <laughs> I was like, fuck it, you know, I don't feel like coming home and, you know, you know, making food and 
eating that way. So I was like, fuck it, I'll just grab that, eat that, and call that, you know, my night. And then I went on to VR chat after I got done eating those ribs because I did not want barbecue sauce all over my freaking keyboard. <laughs> and, uh... <laughs> And then I just got into a group with friends and just went world hopping a little bit and went, had fun. It was, it was a lot of fun. I can't stop reiterating how much fun I had last night. So, uh, I guess the moral of this is, uh, I'm probably in a better place now than I have been. And socializing is helping, but at the same time, it has to be socializing that you're comfortable with. Uh, if you're in that similar situation where you feel uh, like socializing in general can be a drain on you, I'm maybe not entirely introverted, but I'm close enough to that particular sort of mindset that my... Uh, energy is just drained after a day of work usually that uh maybe if you find something like this it'll be enough to you know get you out there get you out there and get you social and i honestly would recommend it if you can find any way to do so do it if it's vr chat it's vr chat if it's a different sort of you know social game it's that if it gets you out there and gets you having fun with people, do it. I have been feeling a little socially isolated because of my general behavior that I don't like going out. I don't like, you know, socializing after work or, you know, just go, just going out in general. It feels like a chore. But this was a lot of fun. Anyway, I keep I keep going on and on and on about it. Jesus fucking Christ, Tom, shut the fuck up. Anyway, uh, <laughs> I'm going to end the video here. Uh, just wanted to let you guys know uh, that's the reason why uh, I was actually having fun. For once, <laughs> I was having fun. So don't judge me too harshly. Uh, if you happen to see me in VR chat, by all means, come up, say hi, tell me, you know, how you've seen me, you know, if you see me at all, uh, if you know me from YouTube or Twitch or whatever, uh, do come up, do come up and say hi. I would love that. So anyway, uh, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more and click the like button if you like this particular video and share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together and the ways we're socializing because we're weird children <laughs> me being the weird grown ass children that I am and I will see y'all in the next video this has been the one the only stray cat playing games vlogging uh, being social for once in a drastic turn of events and just having fun that's all we can do is just try to have fun it's like shit it shouldn't be as hard as it is, but sometimes it is. But when you do it, fuck, enjoy it. So, anyway, for you.